All right, today I'm really excited because I'm gonna show you how you can speed up your website by simply doing two really easy things. But before that, I want you to go to tools.pingdom.com and we wanna test the speed of your website where it's at right now. So type it in right here, go ahead and choose the closest server and start test. All right, so the results are in. The load time is 5.89 seconds, and that's not very good. It really should be about three seconds or less. Uh, it's been shown that if it's not uh, three seconds or less, a lot of people will leave your page. So to improve that, the first thing I want you to do is log into your WordPress account. I want you to go to plugins, add new, and I want you to type in W3 total cache, and I want you to get and activate this plugin. So I already have it installed. I'm just gonna go ahead and activate that really quick. So now that it's activated, go ahead and go down here to performance, general settings, and from your general settings, I want you to scroll all the way down to the bottom. And here in the, in the bottom of the description, I actually have a file that you can upload that has all of my uh, settings. It's uh, preloaded, so just go ahead and download that. Choose the file. And simply hit upload. All right, so that's it for that. The second thing I want you to do is go to your Bluehost account, go ahead and log in. And go ahead from the cPanel, scroll down to Cloudflare. Click on that. Now Cloudflare is a really cool free service that you can get. There is an um, uh, upgrade you can do that provides more, um, I guess, features. However, this free one will increase the speed of your website. So all you need to do is sign up for an account. Down here, I, I already have one. Once you do that, you come back here and you'll see the site, so simple content creation. All I want you to do is activate it. Once it's done activating, I want you to go ahead and enable these three clouds right here. After that, hit the Advanced tab. And down here, uh, you'll have a few more options that I want you to click. For caching level, like aggressive, rocket loader, automatic, and then change this to this bottom one right there. And once all these are enabled and you have that, then what I want you to do is go back and test your website. And so from here, we'll go ahead and retest it. All right, so we just re-ran the test, and here you can see that the load time dropped all the way down to 1.88 seconds, and that is a huge difference. And so there you go. I just wanted to show you how you can do those two quick, simple things to improve the speed of your website. I hope that helps you out.